All right, good morning. In setting up a plant aquarium, one of the most important things to get is carbon dioxide. But not only carbon dioxide as in bubbles in the aquarium, carbon dioxide as diffused into the water of the aquarium. So what I'm about to show you is the way I diffuse my carbon dioxide inside the water. The concept here is to try to get carbon dioxide to stay in the water as long as you possibly can. So this is the aquarium. This is the CO2 do-it-yourself generator. It actually has a little baby bubble counter at the back there. And then from there, it goes into the aquarium and it gets shoot into this test tube. It rises to the top of the test tube and the little water pump pushes the water into the test tube so it can actually cause some turbulence and start to break up the carbon dioxide molecules so it can diffuse into the water. So in doing this, I'll just start adding carbon dioxide by shaking the do-it-yourself carbon dioxide. You're going to see it's going to shoot up soon. There you go. It's starting to fire in and it's there. So now carbon dioxide is fired into the test tube and it's being bombarded by water. And it looks kind of cool to see it bubble up and move like that. Now the concept here is to keep carbon dioxide into the, in the water as long as you can and to try to bombard it so that it can be diffused. As it diffuses, it enters the water from gaseous form in sort of a liquid form and it's more easily available for plants to pick it up. They can actually absorb it much better. And with that said, these are my plants. I think this is like a little 15 gallon aquarium with a 9 watt bulb. And it's doing pretty well so far. And the substrate is sand, and underneath the sand is clay.